advantage. Pay attention at school kids.
the watercraft are in behind there, fully accessible. That's a cubby house in under the front porch. But if I go backwards from there, the red brick on the bottom is basically, that is the level of the floor inside the house. So from there down and another foot or 18 inches below this level, down in there is the cavity under the house. So it's that high plus another foot or more. So my plan is to put in a lentil up here to hold up those bricks, put in a lentil up here to hold those bricks up, take these bricks out to make a new cavity space, a new access to the cavity space underneath there. And under there, I can put in some uh, giant pull-out drawers under there, which will give me a lot of storage space. So that's the plan. I'm gonna go back under the house and do some more accurate measuring and writing down on a piece of board. Draw it up. So there's the hole I was talking about that's already missing. And then one, two, three bricks. So here I am under the house. It's just a crawl space. Um, not enough room to stand up, obviously. I'm sitting at the moment and it's just that high. The watercraft cubby, cubby hole is behind that wall there. So, and if you can see it, that's the missing brick on the other side. Now, obviously that's a column and that's a column that's holding the house up. So I've got that much space I can take out without affecting the structure of the house and the same on the other side of that column. Okay, so now I've got my measurements from underneath the house. I can draw on this wall where the house piers are. plan here that's the timber I'm using it's uh, 200 220 it's 220 by 100 good Aussie hardwood so it's absolutely solid I'm not going anywhere that's in the old money that's nine inches by 220 by so it's nine inches by four inches of the hardest, hardest Aussie hardwood. Because the timbers I have are not long enough 
to do the full span, I'll put a nice big fat uh, overlapping joint right on top of that column there. So that'll be no problem. And I'm confident with that plan. Famous last words. Don't tell Rosie. It is. No, it'll be all good. Seven years of planning coming together. 